we're in beautiful Yantai, Seaside City of Lights. And you can see behind me the light show on the buildings. We are by the seaside and the waves are torrential in the snow. And behind me is the Yantai Lighthouse for their two tickets to paradise. Chinese New Year Festival here in the beautiful city of Yantai, which I recommend all of you come to see in Shandong province. We're gonna go up on that hill where they have a lighthouse and a giant festival. Let's go check it out. We're officially past the gate. There are rabbits, there are kids' prizes, and this is the national tourist attraction, Quadruple A. Let's go. We have made it past the ticket booths and we are in. You can see these very elaborate Chinese New Year rabbits, the light show behind us. We haven't quite gone up to the lighthouse yet, but we did see a sign that this is a national tourist attraction, Quadruple A. That's gotta be pretty good. So let's go, let's go check it out. It's now called Seaside City of Lights for nothing. Look at the lights in this beautiful spring festival spectacle. This place is a spectacle of lights. There are lights everywhere. I think that might be point of the show from what I can see so far. Over here, we still have not made it up to the lighthouse, but there are lights going down everywhere. I want to go into this magic playland that looks like something out of Avatar at night. Given that seafood is one of Yantai's major exports, it's not a surprise that many of the lights here in this location are based on the seaside. Underwater things, wreaths, coral, fish, sea turtles, and more. And a giant astronaut, of course. I think one of the takeaways is, look at this from our height. You know, five and a half, six feet tall. I'm six feet tall. Imagine being a child and walking around in this wonderland, all of these objects would be considerably taller than you. So as a child, looking at this amazing view, it must be a completely different kind of super magical experience. And just look at this, how happy this young child is right here. It looks like the solar system a little bit. I'm not sure what planet that is. Maybe it's Earth or Neptune. We got Saturn. Over there is the sun, a giant astronaut, and the moon. Now we have to go to the next level up here where more delightful surprises are in store. A lot of people say back in Rome that when you pass into Elysium, fields of wheat would await you. We have reached the penultimate deck. That means the second to the highest deck. And behind me, you can see the lighthouse I've been telling you about, which is one of the reasons Yantai is known as Seaside City of Light. And behind you is a giant spring festival, Chinese New Year rabbit for the year of the rabbit. Wow, there's the lighthouse. I told you, it's quite a few. We have reached the final destination which is actually a temple for Guanyin. So we're gonna check it out, come on. I didn't win much, but I don't think winning is the point of the game. It is playing, and I felt happy pretty much the whole time I was playing, along with my producer who played as well. Four more to have a Pikachu. Oh no. Okay. Pikachu, Pikachu. Hey, <laughs> 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 
But we won something tonight. Thank you. Thank you. There's an international production of Karate Kid with Jaden Smith and Jackie Chan that shows a very beautiful spring festival like this one, a Chinese New Year festival. And this is the best one that I've been to. The only one of its caliber that I have been to in my 10 plus years in China. And it was in Yantai Shandong, Yantai, Seaside City of Lights. Come and check it out for yourself.